Hey guys, what is up? It has been forever. Haven't been around, haven't seen you guys. Um, and I realized it's been a really long time since I have done just a let's have a chat kind of a vlog. Um, because I really haven't done vlogs in a really long time. Um, I don't know, I kind of just wanted to touch base with y'all and let y'all know like what's been going on. Um, it's nothing serious, like there's nothing really specific going on um, that would prevent me from doing videos. Wow, everyone around me is looking at me really weird right now. Um, I don't know how... <laughs> I don't know how people do the whole like public vlogging thing without being completely embarrassed out of their mind. Because um, I'm just driving in the car right now and I'm a little bit embarrassed by the people that are staring at me. Anyway, moving on. Um, Yes, I'm being safe. Um, I'm going in a straight. I'm going straight. I'm not turning anytime soon. Um, and I don't have the kids in the car with me. So I am being careful. Just so you know. <laughs> um, anyway, I, I just kind of wanted to talk with you guys. I have not been feeling YouTube lately. And I don't know how to explain it other than I just haven't wanted to do videos. I haven't been motivated. I haven't been um, interested. Um, it's really, really hard to explain. I'm sorry. You guys probably just got a nice shot of my boobs because I can't position the camera correctly. Um, I get embarrassed. Like People start staring at me and the camera starts going down, down, down. Um, ah! Anyways, I just got off work. I'm on my way to get my husband. Um, I'm going to pick him up from work, and then we're going to go get the kids from school, and then we're going to go meet some people for dinner. So um, that's what's going on right now. But uh, I feel as though I've been a little bit shunned by YouTube. Not necessarily shunned. I've been not getting the nicest um, feedback. Um, I have a lot of people send me really hateful messages. Um just a lot of really bad negativity and I'm okay with negativity it's not like I can't take you know constructive criticism or criticism in general but um, when it's constant um, bashing of my videos when it's constant um, you're doing this wrong you're doing that wrong oh you're such a bad mom why would you do that oh your house is disgusting and dirty you should clean your house um, you know just really rude comments I don't appreciate it I don't like it um, and I usually don't let it get to me, but lately, when it's already really difficult for me to make videos, um, time-wise, it's something that I'm like, why do I bother? Like, why is this even worth it um, to make a video? Um, so, you know, I don't really know. Um, I've just been feeling really kind of put off, I guess, by YouTube in general. Um, I'm going to try to get back to it, you know, and I've said that before, so I'm not even going to make promises. Um, I'm so busy, and my computer is so full right now of just junk. I have so much junk just on my computer, and, um, you know, it, <laughs> it makes it harder to upload and edit a video because it takes up just that much more space on my laptop, which I use for work on a daily basis. Um, I don't know. Anyway, I also wanted to talk with you guys a little bit about this anxiety issue that I've been having. And I don't even know if you would call it anxiety. Um, I've been referring to it as social anxiety. Um, I, I've noticed at work especially, especially at work, um, I'll get there and, you know, people will ask me like, oh, how are you doing? Or, or they'll say something nice or like, oh, I like your hair today or, oh, I love your, I love that shirt. And I can never just take a compliment for what it is. I can never just say, oh, thanks. You know, I always have to say something like, oh, thanks. It's old. Or they'll be like, oh, hi, how are you doing? Oh, I'm, I'm tired. Or I have bags under my eyes this morning. Or, you know, something bad always has to be happening or... I always have to be negative about myself or I don't know I just I just can't be positive about myself and I didn't even realize I was doing it um, and I started paying more attention to the way I'm talking to people and I realized that I'm always such a Debbie Downer I just don't I don't ever think <laughs> 
sorry, people are staring at me. I don't ever think um, positively. And, uh, you know, it's a little... Oh, great. Oh, God. I thought I was just getting pulled over by a cop, you guys. That just scared me so bad. <laughs> it was an ambulance going the opposite way. Anyway, I was like, what? They pull people over for vlogging now? What? Um, anyways, I'm trying to go by the bank right now. So I might have to cut this a little short. Um, but uh, I feel like... If I am the one to point out my flaws, say, like, I'm really uncomfortable with myself, I'm super self-conscious, I'm feeling really chubby, I hate the way I'm dressed, I don't like my hair, I just overall, in general, feel like crap. Um, I always feel like I have to be that first person to point out all of my flaws. It's like, if I meet someone new or I see someone for the first time for the day, I feel like, oh my gosh, I have to point out all my flaws right now so that they don't judge me, so that they don't say anything about it first, and so that they understand that I'm aware that I look like crap and that I need to fix this. So it's like if they if they get that I know and, my, and I'm aware that I look like crap, then it's not as bad. <laughs> Does this even make any sense? Do you guys understand what I'm saying? Um, I might sound like a neurotic mess right now. Um, I don't know. It, it, it's been something I've been struggling with for a while now, and it's really, really hard. And I keep saying, I'm on this whole weight loss journey thing, and I keep saying, well, once I lose 30 pounds, I'm going to dye my hair, I'm going to buy new clothes, I'm going to get my makeup, you know, I'm going to get new makeup, um... I'm going to get my teeth whitened. I'm going to do all of these things that's going to make me feel good about myself. And I started thinking, like, wait a minute. So until I lose those 30 pounds, am I just going to get to feel like crap about myself? It's like I've, I've given myself that, the ultimatum of you have to feel like crap until you hit your goal weight. Um, and I think that's a little bit ridiculous and unrealistic. Um, I think that I can hit my goal weight and you know, do all of the, all the things that I want to do, but I don't think I have to wait to feel good about myself. I can feel good about myself with the weight that I am now, and that has to be okay. So, if I can, uh, anyways, <laughs> instead of waiting until I lose my 30 pounds, um, I am going to start doing things that make me feel good about myself now. I'm going to, you know, get my hair done. I'm going to start working out. I'm going to do things that make me feel good rather than waiting and using them as a reward. Because let's face it, once I lose weight, my reward is losing weight, being skinnier, being healthy. Um, I shouldn't need a, an incentive to, um, to continue losing weight because I can look pretty and feel good about myself before then. Um, at least I think I can. So anyway, that's about it. I have to go now because this person in front of me is being crazy. <laughs> they think it's a good idea to stop on the interstate apparently. Anyways, um, I will talk to you guys later. I hope I will talk to you guys later. Um, and I hope you all are doing wonderful, absolutely wonderful. And I'm sorry I haven't been around. Um, and you know, I'm going to try to do better. It's just hard you know it's hard because I, I'm not motivated anymore and it's like for the longest time I felt like YouTube was like my go-to thing like I was bored or I, and so I made YouTube videos and now my life is just so busy and hectic and with all of the negative feedback and everything that I've been getting um, I just I haven't felt as though it's worth it um, to vlog my life anymore but um, we'll see we'll see what happens and where things go but uh, I'll talk to you guys later I hope you all are all doing really well and yeah, sorry. I keep, like, hitting the roof of the car. And also, I'm sure you guys get a nice view of, like, from my eyebrows down for this whole video because I do not know how to hold this camera properly. Um, I haven't mastered that yet, so I'm sorry. I apologize for that. Um, anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.